straight out of Bulls Fest, and the Cognac Boys was there. Mark Eversley held the meeting. And in that meeting, he had some words about why did he pick up all of his free agencies that free agents that he targeted. We're gonna talk about it. But you know what? Y'all gotta hear the music first. Cognac. Gang. Shy Boys Podcast with the Cognac Boys. I am Cognac Boy C-Dub, holding it on for another episode with my traveling nephew. He on his way to Atlanta, Georgia. What's up, guys? Hey, we went to Bulls Fest yesterday, and it was kind of lit. I ain't going to lie. And Mark Eversley definitely had an interview. I was like 10, 15 feet away. And he talked about signing the signing of the three, three main free agents we got on this team. Nick Vooch, Ayo Dusumo, and Kobe White. According to Mark Eversley, at the Bulls Fest interview, which I was 15 feet away, said re-signing Vooch was tops on their list along with Ayo and Kobe White. Well, as soon as we lost to the Miami Heat in the play-in tournament last year, first on everyone's mind are what we're going to do with our free agents, Nikola Vucevic, Ayo Dusumu, and Kobe White. We must give it up because the Chicago Bulls was very consistent in their replies when we t we want to resign them. They just going to tell you we want to resign them. Every time we ask the question, we want to resign them. And you blank and you can't blame them. All three players, although flawed in their own way, hold a certain level of promise and curiosity and stability. Excuse me. Let's talk promise. I'm going to give this distinction to Kobe White and really Kobe White's game has not been defined yet and yes that's a good thing Kobe White came into this league as a scorer and that's pretty much it and every year he has drastically changed his game to the point where he's basically a totally different player from his rookie season and guess what Kobe White is only 23 years old and with his continued appetite to get better, three years and 40 million is a steal, or it will become a steal very soon. Curiosity. I will have to bestow this on Ayo Dusumu. We all seen his rookie season thrust into a role because of injury, speeding up his maturity with no warning. And guess what, gang? He held his own. But the following year, we've seen a bit of decline exclusively at the three-point line. I feel like that's the only part of this game that regressed his second year, and I'm willing to bet he will bounce back and become an even better player. Ayo Dusumu, the whole city behind Big Gall, all he has to do is put it together. I think he can put it together this season. And when it comes to stability, really quick, we will be associating that with Nick Vooch. I'll be honest. It's a mixed bag with Vooch. His pick and roll defense is awful. It's ass. It's cheeks. And at best, he can linger at the three-point line a bit too much. But what you're going to get from Nick Vooch is a daily is a daily bait. On a daily basis, you can pretty much count an 18 and 12 double double. Every game. And it's definitely a top 10 center in a game when it comes to offense. Vooch showed effort on defense yesterday, uh, last year that we haven't seen since he's been in Chicago. We've seen a guy sitting in the chair. We've seen him actually block two or three shots for the whole season. That wasn't a joke. It was refreshing to see from Nick Vooch from getting in a thing. So I think it was a good move. Where are you going to find a better center than Vooch? You're not going to find a better center than Vooch. All the really good centers are locked up. So if you have one, you better keep them. And that's what the Chicago Bulls did. In conclusion, the Chicago Bulls actually get applause on this one. They kept the promise on a mission that they, they actually completed a mission. You know what I'm saying? That they said they were going to do. We are going to sign our free agents. Not just one or two. We're going to sign all three of our promising players and one stable player in Nick Vooch. 
So this has been a quick video from the Cognac Boys. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, share if you want. And I'm going to hit y'all on the next Shabu's Podcast. Peace. Cognac. Gang.